Welcome to Fast Performance TV, I'm Claudio Encina. This is where we pile on the resource, give you an idea, provide a strategy, and help you become much, much more successful. So I'm gonna talk about a topic today, it's about called closing with confidence. How many times have you gone to a listing presentation and felt like you just haven't had the confidence to ask for the business? So here are four tips that I will share with you that will boost your confidence, help you win business, and understand what closing with confidence means. So firstly, the thing that I understand about closing, it's a natural conclusion to a well-executed listing presentation. Yet, I see too many agents today still going with this dreaded, fearful, frightening experience to ask for the business. So their inability to close just shuts down. So help me start with number one in our tips that will help you win more business. So number one is having the right attitude. You must go in with a positive state of mind. So the receptive person on the other end can feel your energy and can feel your positiveness. Remember, how you feel on the inside projects to those on the outside. So if you're feeling nervous, you're feeling fearful, don't you believe the prospect on the other side is gonna feel that? They're gonna think, is this the right person to sell my home? So understand that you've gotta go in with a positive state of mind. Also, see it as your opportunity. Now, many, many times I see agents who've lost three or four listings in a row and their confidence just goes all the way down. So the thing you need to do is see it as your golden opportunity to win the next business. Here we go, tip number two, begins when you pick up the phone. I want you to understand, the moment you pick up the phone, you set the process and the strategy, these little things will boost your confidence. But you can't treat the close as one big event. It's really a sequel of like different events that actually lead to the big close. So it all starts from the moment you pick up the phone. Thirdly, trial closes. Trial closes is about when you agree on open times, you agree on the marketing with the prospect, you agree on what solicitor they're gonna use, and you agree on your terms and conditions. All of these little trial closes add up to one big close, and it should come naturally. The fourth one is a powerful and successful close naturally follows a well-planned and executed listing presentation. This is just a whole sequence of logical little steps that lead to a natural big close that will help you win more business and more listings. I hope these four tips and insights can help you today get more business. I hope to see you soon.